All right, so we have to rotate figure ABC 90 degrees clockwise around the origin. So the origin is where the X and the Y axis intersect, and a clockwise rotation is going to go in this direction. So right now our object is in quadrant number two, and we're going to end up rotating somewhere to quadrant number one. Remember, this is quadrant one, quadrant two, three, and four. Now in quadrant number one, we should know that all of the X values are positive, as well as the Y values, and this is going to be important for what we're about to do. So first, we have to identify the original coordinates. So point A is located at negative 5 on the X and positive 3 on the Y axis. Point B is located at negative 3, positive 4. And point C is located at negative 2 and positive 1. All right, so to rotate, 90 degrees in either direction, clockwise or counterclockwise, all you have to do is take your X and your Y values of each point and switch them around. So we're going to take 5 and 3 and write 3 and 5. We're going to take 3 and 4 and switch those. It's going to be 4 and 3. And then we're going to take negative 2 and 1 and switch it to be 1 and 2. Now first, I disregarded the sign altogether. I just looked at the absolute value. Because after you switch those values, then you have to determine, is your X value going to be negative or positive? Same thing with your Y. And because we know we are rotating this object to quadrant number one, everything is going to be positive. A is going to be moved to 3, 5. B is going to be located to 4, 3. And C is going to be located to 1, 2. So let us go ahead and plot those coordinates. So point A is going to be at 3 and 5. So our new point A is going to be located right here. B is going to be at 4 and 3. So that is our new point B. And C is at 1, 2, which is right here. And this is exactly where our rotated shape is going to end up at. 